Welcome to Upstate Tractor Works. Here we are this morning at the Greenville Pickens Speedway for an equipment auction with Johnny King. So if you will, please like, subscribe below. Need to build our subscribers. We appreciate you. Show you some stuff from the auction today and maybe show you some auction action. Thanks a lot and let's go. Okay, we got some tractor stuff here. Got a little spreaders in the auction today. Like I said, this is the Johnny King auction in Greenville. A big Massey Ferguson ripper there. Bush hog with no slip clutch. Transfer tank. It's a grapple. This thing weighs a lot. Here we got some forks. Looks like they've got some of the auction started over here already this morning. We got some trailers, we got a little bobcat. <laughs> Homemade trailer here. Got a 743 bobcat. Like it's been rode quite a bit. Walk on down the line here. Got a little bit four foot bush hog over there and a post hole digger. Air conditioners. <clears throat> There's your dune buggy chassis. If you need a chassis for a dune buggy. Couple of old Thunderbirds. Aluminum on is. Military cot. The new B dog house. <laughs> There's a gale loader of turbo over there. Plenty of tires. Trencher here. Got a Kohler engine on it. It's like a 24 inch depth, 3 inch. Got some wheels here. Here's another post hole digger. Some ladders. Some roofing or metal trusses if you want to build your barn. Bunch of toilets. Mm -hmm. 
Now we're getting into the trucks and cars. A little Toyota truck for sale today. A little Scion. And the Explorer four wheel drive. There's your cat excavator. has a hydraulic foam on it. All right. Looks like we got a portable steam cleaner. Boy, look how they tried to cover that rust up. Here's some more equipment. Got a farm all C tractor. Yeah. <laughs> now they must be a starter on it somewhere there's a battery uh, old Massey Ferguson it's a pull tight bush hog sometimes you wonder where they drug these things out of the woods from this one don't look like it's run in a while here Master Ferguson 35 Deluxe. Yeah. Just another bush hog. This looks. Yeah. Now here's a. Like a vendor trailer, it looks like. Somebody sold produce out of it. Here's Bill's Produce's truck, too. All right, we got some trailers. Who would want a large con enclosed trailer like that with no title? So you couldn't put a license plate on it. You couldn't travel outside of the state of South Carolina. Barn doors on the back, and somebody painted it up to try to hopefully make it look better. But that right there is the killer for most people. Because you get stopped in North Carolina with that trailer, they give you a nice little ticket. All right, we got more and more trucks. There's your Dodge. A big tra Tex trailer. Yep. Toyota, only 366,000 miles on that one. Now here looks like a decent used trailer. It's factory built. A lot of these at these auctions are home built and they end up with welds that are broken and things like that. But this one looks like it's been taken pretty good care of. Got the ramp strapped up front. Uh, fender's been a little bit, but it won't hurt nothing. You can pull that back out. There's where the ramps can be slid under the bottom instead of strapped to the top. At least they did put a nice electric jack on the tongue. All-wheel drive Lincoln. Uh-oh, we got a boat. Got a boat here at the auction today, 18 footer. We can go to the lake this afternoon. Yes, sir. -y. Lumacra. Yep, even has the front seating area. Look, there's not even a cover for the fuses. That way water can splash all in it. Yep. You got you a big old 100 four stroke Yamaha on here. They hadn't chewed up too much with the prop on that one. Yeah. Got a Malibu LT. 
environmental industrial services van that's Harley Davidson edition. Something tells me that somebody added that. I don't know. <clears throat> Here comes a personal watercraft, a jet ski. Everybody needs something to play with in the summertime. See, it even holds water. Um, I think part of the seat's missing. Now here's you some serious beams right here. Yeah, 23 four inch beams, 18 foot long. Yeah, buddy, you could, I bet them things is heavy. You want you one of them? Yeah, there's a tree shear. Yeah. Then if you need your big old trash can, there's just some big trash cans. Some more skid steer equipment here. Some fences. There's a bunch of stuff at this auction today. Yeah, big toolboxes, stainless. You can even buy yourself a miniature container here today. Yep, shipping container. It even has a walk-in door on the side, make your little office. Now in this auction, they've got some 40 footers, but I don't know if they're on site. I didn't realize there's a camper over there in the auction today. We'll have to go look at our camper. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, portable, portable toilet. Now there's your three point hitch swing arm bush hog. There's just some serious tables. This is a class. Now is that three point hitch or is that? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, it's at least class two or class three. That's gotta take a big tractor. That'd be a 75 horsepower probably or better tractor to haul that arm. Here's your Jeep. Now, if you ever wanted a hitch adapter, they got plenty of the, the hitch, ball hitches here for sale. Yep. Got your Hustler lawnmower with a blowed out jack shaft. Rusted out. Rusted out. Look how they done screwed plastic back together where that was rotten. Yeah, there's your transfer tank. Yeah, you can buy it. It can be yours today. Uh, yeah, got all kind of four-wheeler tires, air compressor. I hope everybody's enjoying the walk around today. We got my son's here visiting with me, so he came out today liking all this stuff. Now, he's got a truck big enough to pull that. He got one of them scooper duties. Now, I, I like this. Sir, it don't have enough tires. Hey, you gotta have duels. Yeah, look on down. There's your dump bed. There's the actual speedway that this is at. Greenville Picking Speedway is the asphalt track here in Greenville, South Carolina. They have the auction out here in the parking area. All righty, we got a Bruick. Wonder how many miles? 170,000 miles on the Bruick. Got some used Bridgestone Doodler tires. Got a Yamaha Grizzly. Yeah. A one man electric golf cart thingy. Got all kind of connections. That thing is power your house almost. <laughs> Pepsi cooler. And here's some insulated panels. Looks like they're gonna sell some insulated coolers. Yeah, there's a bunch of them here. Now, here's what you call a trencher. <clears throat> yes, sir. I didn't bring a trailer big enough to haul it home. We had to buy this trailer. No title. Uh, oh, no title on the trailer. Hey, there's your little four foot scrape blade. Yeah. <coughs> Vermeer, that's yeah, this is a nice unit. This one will probably be up in the ten thousand dollar range. We got a good I 
I guess that's a good six inch, eight inch, something like that. Yeah, oh, here's you an old, never heard of a holler. Anybody had a holler? Holler back. <laughs> I think this one's been run pretty good. It's been burned up. Uh oh. Something. I don't, it's just got grease all over it. Yeah, yeah how you like that handy dandy vice grip to hold the thermostat in? Yeah. Oh, here's a. AC uh, <laughs> I don't think air conditioning's been oh, running no. on this thing in a while, so. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, buddy. At least it has a hydraulic pump. Here's a, some more plows out here. Yep. All right, we're gonna walk on around here, and I'm gonna take you a tour of that camper, and then we're gonna go watch some of them. There's your trailer. Got duels. A premiere. No title. Yeah. I guess a lot of people stay within their state and don't need titles. There's somebody in the outback. Yep. Here we got an outback camper by Keystone, 23 footer. Oh, hello. Hello. And then, yeah, water damage there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the bad thing about campers, they always get wet. <sighs> yep. Both corners up front there, Ben, are just waterlogged. Uh, Look at that, folks. It's just waterlogged. Look in the wall right here. See the wall buckles? Ooh, gross. And then this is a toy hauler that's got a yeah, door. I, I was like, dang, this is nice. And then the freaking walls are jacked. But I don't think a Harley would fit in there too good. Uh, Doesn't look wide enough. Uh, take the roll back. Nice and clean in here. Yeah. Aluminum bed. It's not for hire. I wasn't planning on hiring him today anyway. Some more tanks. Here's a Massey Ferguson 30 tractor. It's time for some tars. And oil. Oil's dripping. That's diesel fuel, I think. It's got a leak. It's got some kind of leak where the diesel's leaking out of it. Oh. Here, all over this side of the engine is diesel, mm -hmm. where it's leaking out of the injector pump somehow. So all that needs to be redone. Alrighty. All right. We're gonna take a little break here. We'll bring you back in some of the auction action. 